Hey guys, welcome to another edition of King's Mailbag with defenseman Derek Forbert. Now, Derek, you were a part of Nick Dowd's. He phoned a friend, so you're familiar with this format. So we're going to jump right into it. And the first fan question was, who was your favorite NHL player growing up? Who did you look up to? Oh, it's easy, Marion Gabrick. So then what's it like playing on a team with him now? No, I'm just kidding. Let's... Oh. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. Yeah, I mean, he was kind of like the big player like, growing up in Minnesota, but my favorite player was probably Nick Lister, just watching him and the way he played, and uh, I just kind of really gravitated towards that style. So if you weren't playing hockey, what other sport would you be great at? Did you play any other sports? Um, I was an intramural volleyball champion in college. What? But, uh, yeah. I actually, I actually took volleyball class too, it was, it was top class, um, so that was probably my, uh, my second sport. Were you any good? Honestly. I was a, I was a grinder out there. Okay. Uh, probably wasn't known too much for my skill out there, more for like blocking and you know, being, a, being a good uh, digger, I think is what they call it. Who are you closest with on the team? Um, probably the Grizzly Bear, Nick Shore. Uh, I don't know, we kind of went to high school together for... We did go to high school together for a year in Ann Arbor, and you know, we were pretty good buddies there. And then you know, played, we lived together in the minors for two years, and then playing together up here. So that's kind of crazy that you've been able to play with him yeah. throughout almost your entire career. Yeah, I uh, took a little break during college, but you know we saw each other like three or four times a year, so it was good. What's your favorite movie? Uh, definitely Remember the Titans. Uh, Ooh. Yeah, it's always just been a favorite of mine. And, that whole storyline and, and uh, when the team comes together uh -huh. on that practice scene, that's one of my favorite movie scenes of all time. So inspirational. Oh, I love it. What do you go, what's your go-to meal to either cook or just go out and eat? Uh, well, I, I haven't really been too much into cooking this year. I've just kind of been uh, supporting my local restaurants and uh, I'd say my favorite meal is probably the prime rib dip from Nix. Have you had that? <laughs> No, but is this Nick's in the Metlocks? Huh? Nick's in the Metlock Center in Manhattan Beach? Yeah. Yeah, okay, th th this goes back to the phone a friend when you came in on Nick Dow's uh, mailbag because we asked if you were going to be a sandwich, what would you consist of? And he said you would be prime rib because he can't even describe how many prime rib oh, sandwiches that? <laughs> yeah. that you've eaten. So we're going to actually let you answer this. If you were going to be a sandwich, what would you be? Um, probably something super healthy, like a, like a lean turkey sandwich or something like that. Okay, it's close to almost what you had last time. You said what lean I ham. Say, did I say lean ham? Like a holiday ham. A lean, healthy holiday ham. I do kind of resemble a holiday ham. Okay, so we'll go ham over turkey. Yeah. All right, I'll take that. Now we're going to keep it on the, the food train here. If a taco and a grilled cheese got in a fight, who would win and why? Definitely a taco. Um, I don't know. I, I don't really like grilled cheeses. Just like it's just like bread and cheese. It's not really my thing. Big taco guy, so I'm gonna go with the taco. It's got a lot of substance too. Tacos. It could, it could definitely take over the grilled cheese. Yeah, and it's just like I feel like they just live a like way more rugged lifestyle too. <laughs> grilled cheese are just kind of like you know like your mom makes them like Plain tacos. Game. Tacos are hard. I like it. All right. Nice job. Good work. Thanks. Taco man.